Welcome to Graham Games. My name is Graham. This is a game. Today I'm showing off Dorf Romantic alongside its 1.0 release, leaving early access. I have not played more of this than the tutorial that I've played just, just now off camera, so I won't fully know what has changed from the early access till now, but I thought it looked really chill. I thought it looked like the sort of thing that would become my like girlfriend's favorite game and I thought sure let's let's get in there and give it a try what it immediately immediately made me think of was like a single player Carcassonne if you've ever played that uh, specific board game it's all just about tile placement it hands you out tiles and you have to try to, to match things up so you get extra like bonus points if you I complete these little quests it assigns, like here it's asking me to add a forest tile. I want to leave that house exposed. If I place this, I will be overdoing those quests. That's not what it's asking of me. So I'm trying to, I'm trying to find somewhere where I can do this where I could leave the river. The river is not allowed to run into a tile. It can't just end out of nowhere. So I'm trying to find somewhere kind of open and safe for it to go. I don't know. I, I'm too much of a beginner at this. So I'm kind of potentially throwing that one away a little bit. Trains have the same problem as rivers. They also can't lead into nothing. So I have to be like partially careful about where I'm placing those. Uh, the more you can close off things the better so i can't place that there I've, I've blocked that that wouldn't quite close off homes or anything i thought having trains next to homes would be a, a good thing i thought people would be enthusiastic about that sorry for trying to improve your lives you jerks <laughs> no how did i manage to to make so many bad decisions so quickly there, that's how I can finally get that one. Excellent. It took me a while to get that figured. Uh, we'll sail that river off away from some of that other stuff while we try to figure some of that out. Plus 56? Plus 35? Those are just the amount of points I will gain from that? Or that's how I have to complete that. Add at least 35 trees anywhere? How what what how we what are we how are we counting trees? I don't really know how trees are counted. I'm overthinking this game that is built around just trying to be chill. I'll start a new forest. New forest over there. It'll do entirely its own thing. That forest will match. That river will match. So I'm happy with that. I I, I can't see how any of anyone who lives there could be upset by it. You know what? Let's just <laughs> stick those houses together. You guys can have a happy little house area. I'll, I'll build some fields out yonder. Really? How do I attach you in a way that satisfies? Oh, because I would be closing it off. And if it's closed off, it becomes impossible to meet that requirement. That's the main issue that I'm, I'm creating over there. Yeah. This, that's pretty hefty. Let's stick the big old water tiles out away from things a little bit. Because you're, I, I'm creating a scenario where a lot of stuff has to branch off from there. I'm thinking there's no perfect placement for that one. Not quite. Uh, I could get more forest lined up. I got pretty, pretty imperfect. But here, I, I would have forest continuing in either direction, so that would be a good thing. That's helping me towards my goal. That completes both of those. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now things are making sense. Ooh, I, I, I kind of want a curvy tile or something to pull that stream away. It's a little bit what I'm hoping for there. Let me... Oh, I, I'll have to eventually put something... I don't know if there's curvy tiles. I don't know if there's curvy tiles or not. Curvy water tiles. So let's just keep trying to place any old thing, any old place. Oh, 
you can close it. I do want to close that off then, if that's going to be an option. Immediately not enough. I could place this somewhere like that to kind of start rounding that out. Hey, finally something to do with the tracks. <sighs> There's going to be nowhere to end that. I'm branching out that way until I find pieces that are going to benefit me in like more specific ways. Mm, yeah, we can start a new village out that way. Why not? That sounds lovely. Cute little connection there. Not, not aiming for anything crazy. That's approved. That's a good a, a placement that the game agrees with. That keeps things open. So yeah, I think I, I think I can get away with that and and feel good about it. Try to connect some of those. Yeah, this is the sort of thing I was hoping for. So I can hopefully start joining some of these together. I want to place that there, but it doesn't... It's not allowed. Oh, maybe they're not close enough. Like, they would need to be these two tiles for that little ring to work how I'm wishing that it would. Yeah, it's a very immediate... <laughs> I would need that exact tile again over there. So maybe that's too limiting. We can sing it back. Sing it back on itself. Send it off in another direction there. Sh sure. I don't know, man. Maybe someday I'll find that little piece that I need. Let's just keep trying to build up housing development. There's an amount of trees everyone can be happy with. Keep the fields going strong. There's a pretty pretty solid chaining together of efforts, I would say. That should be enough to satisfy that. Yeah. Yeah, it's coming together. I'm, <laughs> I'm certainly uh, a long stretch away from having, like, maximized yields. Obviously. I'm not... not cashing in hard there oh that would be a good placement i can just create a really simple tile here and if i ever find a perfect placement where everything matches then you get extra bonus points for like sealing it in in a way that checks off multiple boxes so i'll just hold out hope for when i can achieve that hey Oh, I immediately can't put it there. I do want to start hugging in the train track there a little bit so I don't, like, forget about it. That's not perfect, I don't think. I'm perfect is off the table. We're not aiming for perfect right now. Mmm. That is unlikely to be beneficial to me right like that's forcing it in such a stupid way maybe i could just connect those up i'll just hold out hope to the day i can close those off i could end the water there I could open the water back up there i think just ending that could be quite nice though to know that it's dealt with Properly, fully, perfect place. That was a, it was, it was real stoked on that one. Oh, the next water tile is, is next turn, so not, not quite yet. But that, either one of those is good. I like it. That's a useful tile piece. This one's coming with a big, big forest quest. So let me open it up, point it off in a direction. If I, if I place it there, it, it is connected to so many other forest tiles, it almost immediately satisfies it, actually. So that's, that's where I'm sticking that one. Tile unlock. The water train station. Ooh, doubling down on things. Mixing and matching them, layering them together. You better believe I'm not going to know how to make use of that. Oh, close the group 
by placing tiles at the highlighted edges. So I'll keep an eye out for forest tiles. Land tiles? Forest tiles? I think it's the forest edges. Like it's highlighting here in that area. Are there any other flags? I've kind of been missing flags. Add one train track, add one train tracks. So that one limited limited options there. I guess I'll leave some of that open. No, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if I close it with a forest tile. It's it's entirely just a matter of closing it off. So let's let's start something new over here. I can I can start building off that. I, it'll it'll make sense. It'll work out. It'll be connected to too many water tiles, so I'll just instantly fail the quest in either of those two locations. That's a bummer. I guess I'll start a new waterfront over there. There's my train water station. Perfect. <laughs> Satisfied that. Close that. Useless train loop. Never going to take you anywhere that you care about. But it's f it's fine. <laughs> I am trying to close that, so adding additional forest tiles is not going to be helpful to me. There we go. Uh, there should only be like one more way over here. That would be the last piece for me to close. Uh, let's just keep a, a, that going over there. And that one comes with its, with its own quest, so now it's a whole other thing to, to open up again over there. Uh, the housing area is looking good, but I would have to position it in a way to keep things open. It's too much, too many homes. I have to keep it open. That's fine. Uh, <laughs> now all of a sudden the, the decision making has been opened up notably wider. I could close that. Let's close that up. Uh, I've never been that excited about it. It'd be nice to just call it a, a done deal. I could just get more field tiles added in. Where are uh, homes? Homes over here? Oh, I didn't mean to. Can I undo? No, I botched that one. Total failure. That's not great. Get some more tracks. I'll, I'll send it out that way, sure. Let's just try and end this. I don't... I'm trying to find like a nice forest tile to end it with. I don't want to just end it in a stupid rando way that doesn't make sense and doesn't contribute anything. I get a windmill down. It comes with its own quest. I don't know what else windmills do. Keep things open, keep options. Yes, let's just entirely close off that water. I, th I think that sounds reasonable and will be helpful. <laughs> I've created a new water source way out here. Maybe a mistake. Let's close you out. It's just worth points. 49 tiles left. We could we could make it through a full stack of tiles. I'm, uh, I'm sure of it. I don't know what happens after that. <laughs> what other quests we got on the go? I could position you to, to become more forest oriented. Let's try and close up some of this. Just like that. Oh, it would count as failing one. I think I've closed it in a way I can't do it now. Because I always need to be able to add multiple to satisfy that other one but you can't add more it needs to be exactly one maybe there will be a way maybe there will be a way but i i may have screwed myself pretty hard i could start well there's a quest for this one so let's get that back on track get that moving and contributing Maybe it's a mistake to mix together quest tiles for this purpose. The fact that you're creating these limitations on yourself. Because now, now, like, it'll be, you're forcing yourself to create a scenario where you can satisfy both of those. And that's not always going to be easy. 
I'll just chuck a, a relatively open water out there. Again, that's... I'm trying to come up with a way. Have I screwed it? I'm... Oh... Tricky... Let's let's build out the, the housing over here and round the water away from where I'm trying to achieve that. That satisfies one. That keeps an, enough things open, it'll be fine. That is a lot of water tiles. Let me just go ahead and shoot you out that direction and if we can connect things meaningfully on that side then maybe it'll it'll check off the box I'm looking for here. And it'll immediately satisfy that quest. Could just round it back on itself. That's would be kind of funny. Yeah, let's just do it to nail that one quest down. What are you looking for? You seem awfully difficult to to match with. A lot of these are difficult. I've put myself in a position where it's really hard to satisfy these because when I link them up, it would suddenly add 30 tiles or whatever. So I kind of have to start a separate thing there if I want to commit to to maintaining that as well as I can. I would need to keep an eye out for one really particular, like a railroad ending piece. That I, I would want to place there. Yeah, let's round that back out in a different direction. Connecting that up isn't going to help. It starts to get... Tr I, I'm seeing where the difficulty comes in. Because it really seemed like I could just infinitely do things. A lavender biome. And that just sounds fun and nice, doesn't it? Form a body of water with 15 to get Ocean 1, Engineer 1, Champion 2. Okay, the way you start layering in unlocks seems cool. I'm into that. That can't... Oh, because it's water and railroad. Well, that's brutal, isn't it? I could, I could close up a, a water thing and start a new railroad. I... Abandoned this a little bit. What the way you, you move while rotating felt smooth. It felt really satisfying. Is that not count as just adding one? No, because you're also touching those. I was trying to do it in a way where I was like overcoming that. I have, I think, fully blocked that. Windmill will not be achieved. At least I did that one, but that was really not what I wanted to get out of it. New railroad starting over there. I just I just want to close that railroad. I don't have that as an option. Yeah, that keeps that open. That keeps it going. New water. I can just loop that back around until we get her get her figured out. Really? Oh, because it adds, it adds too many. Well, I could start you off in somewhere where I've kind of already started the process. And I've left myself with some silly, weird, not overly logical things to build off of. <laughs> There you go. Sure, let's close that one. Any flags? Any more of those that I'm supposed to be keeping up with? And we'll close... Close that forest off. Big, big honking forest. These railroad tiles are never what I'm looking for. I, oh, I, I would, just by placing that, I would automatically fail the mission that it's attached to. So it doesn't matter where I build that one. But at least I can build towards that. 
Did I just lose or something? I suddenly don't have tiles or I don't I can't view my tiles anymore? Did I do that? Ooh. What? I didn't know any of that w existed or was a thing that I was on some level trying to do. Can I have my my what's coming next thing back, please? That brought it back. I'm glad to have it. I didn't really understand why I lost it. I, I could get a lot of the ways to that with a single placement, so I will be securing that. I could open up some water. I could make a real big water body over there. That could be fun to mess around with. Let's contribute to that village ever so slightly. Let's build onto this already very large forest. Oh, it's still a, a useless track piece for me. Let's try and loop those together a little bit. I, I mostly am... I'm going to make some decisions based around trying to reach out to there. Because I think that'll be fun. Just a, an open, wet tile. Let's do it again, sure. Form a water body with 15 segments. You got a boat, a boat tile now. Ocean 2. Form a train track with 10. I should be trying to build towards that. Maybe attaching to that forest yet again? would be a mistake. It would become very difficult to maintain that. So let's stick that out in a new direction. And I'll keep building my fields out this way. That, that gets me decently towards that. Again. So one, I just gotta look out for one. That should be easy enough. I could... Let's throw it down. Here's the one I was looking for. Close that guy out. Uh, I could contribute to this one a, a few small blocks at a time. I feel like I should round some of this out. Maybe I can direct that towards that other body of water. Ooh. All right, this one wants to be closed. I'll keep building. I don't have to close it with the field, but it feels good to close it with the field. Perfect, this satisfies that and gets me most of the way to that next one. That's the sort of little shortcut I'm looking for <laughs> closing that loop around that way seems like a mistake and I'll never I'll never get towards that if I make decisions like that how many two more spaces to close off over there let's throw down to achieve that at least a little bit yes Water and train brought together and train ended. I could have put that there just to close that. Maybe that's what I should have done. Let's contribute to the house, keep things going. You could just get lost in this game for absolute ever, <laughs> I think. Is uh, what I'm quickly picking up from my time with it. I don't really want to curl that in on itself any more than that. Closed? No, I just opened it again, didn't I? You can be a complete little loop, though. Oh, and another train piece. Let's veer that out. It could go do its complete own thing. Big open water. 
could put that there just to make sure I have more options of where to place additional water tiles when that inevitably comes up. So there will be a perfect placement there that I can attempt to achieve. Instant loss on that target. That would really commit me to a specific thing I don't I don't want because I think it'll be difficult to to see through. This is like a lot of the way towards being complete. I wonder if I should just be focused on completing the existing ones. I haven't been overly smart about that, I don't think. It's a good placement, it's not a perfect placement. I may be giving up on perfect placements largely. Sticky out that way. Oh, and then I can kind of close it off if I wanted. Or redirect it. There, I'll close that one off. That one's gotten excessive. It's very large. <laughs> We're very close. I could just commit hard and... Well, let's close that one off. I'm nearly out of tiles. There, There's really only so much more I can do with these placements anyways, so I should not be overthinking to the extent that I am. <laughs> is, the, is that bonging in the music letting me know? Like, time's almost up. You better be making good decisions. Not seeing a lot of good decisions going on. And to that I say, quit being so critical of me, game. This is my first time. I'm learning. Huge forest card. Afraid I got a lot out of that one. Do they not contribute? Oh, that's blocked off from there. I see how it is. And one lone, lone home. Can I connect you in somewhere? Excellent. I lost track of this a little bit and misunderstood that that was considered a separate field at that one part. So that's why I kind of failed to do anything with that there. I will just create a little closed thing here. One more water tile over there. We'll see that through. So that's quite exciting. Let's build this track out before I totally forget about it. Yeah. Locomotive. I managed to build that out far enough. There's a very serene little groove that you can get into with this game, isn't there? And yeah, new train heading out a new direction. Adding just one, that counts. Okay. And I'll keep building to you, special tile. Oh, there's like a, there's a creature, a creature living in it, a, a little boar or something. Oh my god. That's uh, a lot to try to add. What, what can I build towards instead? That's a really far ways away. I could try and like link those up. I should try and finish that one first. And kind of what I do with these tiles currently right now is not going to matter. My forest connection is something I specifically am, will care about. With limited options left here. Just trying to do whatever I can, really. Try to fill in a few things. Can I position you in a way that keeps the forest open? Not really. The way it lights things up is incredibly useful. A couple, couple little cozy home tiles. Not really what I was looking for, but hey, it liked that placement quite a bit. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not trying to end that forest. Ooh, but I am trying to end that forest. 
It would auto-complete one and fail the other. Oh, man. So I'd automatically fail this one. But I would complete that one. So I think I'll take the, f I'll take the failure. I can only go the one direction with that. I'm trying to finish out that forest anyways. There's two flags here. By closing this out here and here, I would be satisfying two flags, actually. This could be huge. Let's build towards some of that. One more water tile to complete the one. Fail the other. <laughs> That's becoming a all too familiar of a trade-off, isn't it? Just keep that railroad building. Oh, I didn't complete those flags. There's still one more space to block off. Both those are completed. Oh, I'm adding I'm adding tiles to my supply, I think. I'm fairly certain. A big field tiles I want to stick out over there somewhere. Housing. I am not working towards any housing quests right now. Hey, there's there's a leg up on <laughs> on a new one. I do want to keep building out to that. Yeah, let's keep that going. This is something I want to specifically keep alive as well. I'm going to link these up in a way where they both contribute to each other. These field tiles are in my way. Not what I'm looking to do right now. I'm looking for flags. Make sure I haven't uh, avoided important flags. Neither of those, hey? Well, start a new track for myself, I guess, out that way. Flows off a water body. That's, uh, that's probably not the best. I want to add on to this so I can kind of steal from it in a sense. That'll be useful. Exciting. That, that'll close that off in a way I'm not wanting. Ooh, <laughs> that's... <laughs> Got a lot of benefits out of that one. That My long-term placement there went uh, a long ways for me. I could probably wrap up that housing-based one sometime soon-ish. Oh, I, d I already closed that little loop, didn't I? Let's try and pinch that one off. Perfect! Satisfying. Come on, forest path. I believe in you. One more satisfied. Keep building these houses out this direction. contribute to that, I think, with that tile. Yeah, I kind of have to point it out that direction, I think. Dang, not what I wanted to do with any of those, really. But it did just give me a lot of water tiles at once. <laughs> That would complete that one. That's one thing done. And I can actually create like a, a grouping. Oh, no, I can complete this over here. That's what I want to do. Getting excited about different prospects. And I'm like kind of moving on from previous things I had set up for myself. Oh, there's 
there's an end of a train thing that I've been waiting for this whole damn time. Well, let's close that up, shall we? Bing, bang, boom. Everything's cleaned up and looking nice and fancy over there. Happy, happy. Oh, yeah. Forest tile. That keeps that open, yes? I kind of forgot I, <laughs> I was building up this over here. You're... My, you're brain gets drawn in so many directions as you want to keep a specific target moving forward, you know? So maybe I can start finding that tile once I've, like, accessed it. That's my theory. I'll close that out. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Uh, I had started a totally new water path, but actually, I have this right now. I could bring those together and close them up. That's new and seemingly difficult to make use of. Wow. That's That's limiting, I would call it. I'm going to stick you over here in the hopes that someday maybe I can tie you together. Filling things in just feels, feels nice. <laughs> so that's all I'm doing there. Flag. A flag. Oh, lots of things to close off there. Mostly railroad related things that are, don't come up that often and are hard to make strong use of. Anytime I get a, a field tile, I should be placing it over there. I think that would be best for me. Let's, let's open that up a little bit. These home base tiles aren't doing a lot for me. Oh, that's all closed off. I can't, can't participate. Can't get in it. I'd fail one. I didn't get to link up my forest. And it's really looking like I'm not going to get to do that. Session complete in classic mode. There are other modes. You could just toggle the UI to look at all of what you've done. <laughs> so I want I want that back now. <laughs> there we go. Continue in creative mode. You can save. Oh, you could undo maybe if, if your last placement specifically sucked. My game stats. Tiles place 245. 12 perfect placements. Calling it 8% sounds better than just saying 12, 34 quests, 4 flags. I feel pretty good about it for a first attempt, I really don't know. You continue to, to play, you would unlock more challenges. Build towards special tiles to reveal them. Once connected, the tile will spawn a special quest. Fulfill the quest to unlock a new challenge. Oh my gosh, you have a lot of things to work towards and you would be able to continue adding to that. It's a really chill game. There's like nothing to dislike about it. It functions in every way that I thought it would. Calling it like a one person Carcassonne, I think was accurate. I, I really committed to clusters. Here's my fields, here's my houses, here's my water. Forests are a little bit more scattered. That approach didn't work. Probably you want to give yourself options. So you have two fields on the go, two or three waters, so that you don't forcibly connect them and override quests. There's a lot of room to experiment. Obviously, I didn't do the most efficient thing, or else I would have won, and it never would have ended. <laughs> but thank you to the developers for hooking me up with a copy of this. I've been very curious for quite some time. Congratulations to them for seeing it through early access. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you again soon.